Beauty with no booty, but we're gonna get it out. So today we're doing a butt bang. And yo, I ain't talking about my teeth right now. For real? Okay, you just shake her. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. But I don't wanna do that. Hmm? I really don't wanna do that. We'll eat. We'll eat. It's great. It's great. No, if your mouth hurts, go it's ahead. great. Anyways, so we got. Crab legs, corn, potatoes, and sausage, and mmm, y'all. Let me tell you, this is good. I was supposed to wait. Then I couldn't, because I was hungry, y'all. Let me tell you what happened. I ordered this food like an hour ago. Because mm -hmm. you went, you went to the grocery store, you was vlogging, won't you? Exactly. He went to the grocery store, vlogging and everything. Mm -hmm. By the way, make sure you guys go subscribe to his vlog channel. He just got monetized. Yes, sir. Yay! So, he's doing good. Y'all keep supporting. What? Damn, you see? Oh, man. That was me, actually. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah. Well, I don't know. I want to do a butt bang. Cause I be seeing people be doing them, and they do be looking kind of lit. And like every time I see him, I be like, "Dang, I want some seafood now." You know what I'm saying? Especially when we love be doing it, when she be having her sauce. Damn, what the fuck? He was eating our food, bro. I don't care. Look at this. He was eating our food. You know that, right? You know that. Mm -hmm. Mm. He ain't gonna tell you, but I'm gonna tell you. Ooh, chill. Y'all, it's it's hard picking eating crab legs with nails, cause dang, I already messed it up. It'd be hard to pull it. I'm kind of upset because of it's like still warm, but you know, like it's not the same when it's like fresh out. Like we already kind of live far from it. And then the seafood guy, I mean the delivery guy. I'd be much to me, motherfucker. Huh? Can I put my scratch over here? Ugh. Ooh, look at that, y'all. The other day we eat some seafood. And DC gonna look at me and say, slow down. I guess I'm eating fast. But I was hungry that day too. Just like I am now. But now look who eating fast, they going in. It's good. Which one you think? Huh? It's great. Which one you think is better? This one or the other one? The other one. Mm -hmm. This one ain't got no. Mm -hmm. It's just saying. I mean, I'm not gonna try to talk to him too much, CA. Cause his mouth hurt, y'all. I'm straight, man. I'm straight. I'm straight, y'all. <laughs> Okay. What do you want to talk about? Well, we you can still talk to him though. Huh? You can still talk to him though. What you mean? You can still talk to him like you did well. Don't try to handle some business around. <laughs> you know what you trying to do? You trying to hold a conversation well. Hmm. We were supposed to be going to Alabama. Can I tell them that? We're going to be like a surprise or something. Mm. I ain't gonna be out of the or anything. Mm. But, um, uh, we're supposed to go to Alabama because he got to pick up a car and his chain or whatever. And I'm kind of excited because he's taking me with him. So I probably get to meet some of his friends. His family probably. You let I go. Mm. I'm going to meet your family. Shit, ain't nobody you can meet with. Oh, for real? Mm. 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 Dang, that hurt. That's happening. 
Then I'm going back to my apartment. Um, cause I need to pack my stuff up there. Cause my lease is about to be up. I'm gonna pack my stuff up. Cause I don't know if y'all know, but I am moving to Texas. Um, I'm an official online student, which means I'm yeah. finishing school here. Um, also, I'm gonna be finding me an apartment down here soon. Just waiting. Uh huh. Mm. I'm struggling with this one. I'm just waiting on some things, but I'm gonna be what the fuck? I'm gonna be moving into my own apartment soon, which is gonna be a blessing. You know, just to get back to what I used to do. Like I used to meal prep. Like when I was in college, I would meal prep. And I would have meals all the way for a week. And y'all, I would do it every Sunday. Like I had a whole routine. So now that I'm here, I'm gaining weight because I'm like always eating out, like not cooking. I'm not working out. Like I used to walk at least three miles every day. Literally. At least. But now, I didn't do none of that. Shit, I'm eating a lot though. But, mm, that's what happened. And then, my sister and my best friend, they're coming here. We're gonna get an Airbnb. Now, <clears throat> right, you know, we're about to turn up. And that's it. We're gonna play bag of stuff. Like, when I was young, I always wanted to get like an Airbnb and play bag of stuff. I even tell myself at first, like I wanted to be in Badgers Club for a free. Um, mm, 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 mm. Comment down below right now if you and your cousins ever played Badgers Club or if you ever wanted to be in Badgers Club. And if you know what I mean, you know what I mean when I mean play Badgers Club. I feel like everybody in their cousins used to play Badgers Club, fighting each other. Kicking that one cousin out the room and being mean. <laughs> and they gonna tell on you, you get in trouble, bro. <laughs> we have had some good times. Like, mm -hmm. I feel like nowadays, kids, they don't know, right? They like watch other kids play. We used to actually pay, right? I feel like my generation is the generation that cut off from kids actually like playing outside and stuff like that. Cause we used to play outside. We used to go to the park. We stayed at the park. Like me and my cousins, we used to get up mad early, do our chores, and go to the park and be there all day. We'll sit on a swing. We'll go like inside the gym. We'll watch the boys outside play basketball. Like, but now, how? How? Nowadays, kids just watch each other play. Online, which is like, what the fuck? Hell no, we was outside with it. And too many of y'all don't know about that green tank, but we used to sit outside on that green tank. But that was more so high school though, sitting outside on the green tank, talking shit, smoking. Well, I never smoked, but the dudes I was with, they probably smoking. Mm, you too, sir, man. What was you doing? What were you doing at school? What a normal nigga do in high school. <laughs> Which is? Skip. You skip path. What? You just skip class? But get what though, nobody knew the secret. Which was? Everybody tried to do that. But everybody ain't know I was doing my work the whole time and leave. Mm -mm. See, I never skipped class but once. So I can't say never. But I did skip then, class. I was cool to teach, so. They, they had me on Facebook. Mm. Mm -mm. See? I was great. I was a little rebel once. I skipped class for senior skip day. Sorry, mom. <laughs> And y'all, y'all, that was the worst experience. That was actually the first time I did something I was not supposed to do. And y'all, the whole day I had to pay for it. That'd be a different conversation. But, mm -mm. come in. Huh? Mm 
Mm-mm. Oh. I, mean, I wasn't the one that skipped. I was actually like a teacher's girl. Like, not the teacher's pet, but like, I did my work, yeah. The teachers liked me, cause I didn't go in and bullshit around like a lot of other students. Mm. Mm. But I was still with goofy, you know what I'm saying? I still had personality, so I made them laugh. I don't know. I was too scared to skip. Like my mama, she knew everything, bro. Like even when she don't know, she know. Like she just say something and it be so fucking right. And I'd be like, bro, how do you know? Like, I'm convinced mm -hmm. my phone was tapped. I used to hate that. Like when I get in trouble, first thing my mama do is take my phone. And when she take my phone, she'll go through it. And bro, that's how I got caught with a hickey. She went through my uh, messages. Y'all remember Kick? Y'all remember Kick? Yeah. My little boyfriend, he put a hickey on my neck at the time. Or whatever, I was in high school. Well, he put a little hickey on my neck at the time. And I covered it up when I got home. And I sent a message to my friends. Like a before and after, I was like, like y'all look, she ain't gonna never notice. And I remember this like, it was yesterday. We was out to eat. And I show her something. And you know how you show your mom something and just keep swiping. So her swiping through my photos ended up her going through my messages. And my mom already knew what group chat to go through. She knew not to go through me and my boyfriend group chat because I deleted it. So she went through me and my friends. And baby, it was all there. She freaking seen it. And she got quiet. And I was like, what's wrong with mom? And she was like, so I'm not going to see it. Bruh, I remember the whole, con I remember just the whole table was awkward, eating out was awkward. Then we got home, and like the whole car ride, she was just quiet. When we got home, oh, she talked to shit. She cussed me out. She let me have it. Y'all, and all I can remember the whole time was thinking like, dang. I hope that shit else in that damn phone. Like, I don't know, I think if I have a kid, I don't know if I'm gonna go through her phone. Mmm. I feel like I want it to be a situation where, cause me and my mom relationship, at that time, it wasn't good. So I kinda want our relationship to be where she'll wanna come tell me stuff. But at the same time, my mama wanted the same thing for me too. And that didn't happen, so I don't know. But I'm gonna try to train. I, I don't. I wanna. I wanna raise my daughter not in fear. Cause when you raise your children in fear, if they feel like they can get away with it, they'll do it. But if you raise them to do stuff just because of the principle, when they not and yo, you know, when they not around you and stuff like that, they are gonna do stuff just because. And that's what I want. So mm, that's I'm gonna raise my child. Cause I know I feared my mom. Like when I was here. Which is why I didn't do certain stuff when she was around. But when she wasn't around, it was a party. Like, I'm not perfect. I used to sneak people in. But the greatest part was, I wasn't sneaking boys in. I was sneaking like my friends in. Like my mom, she had a rule like when she was at home, we can't be outside and people can't be in her house. So I used to sneak like my friends, my girls, my girlfriends in and stuff like that. All types of stuff. Mm, look at that. But yeah, y'all. Mm -hmm. Y'all comment down below if y'all were snuck in or snuck out. Like, what was some, some, dang, there was a lot of juggling. Mm. What's some bad stuff y'all did? Comment down below. Let me see. Let me see how bad y'all are. Oh. Y'all we used to, bro. When I was a kid, like growing up or whatever, I used to look like in an urban to easy for me to come. No. I'm good. I'm finna get what? Eat some cereal. Don't eat no cereal right after that. Ooh. That's gonna hurt. 
my stomach not like your what? I told you that. My stomach is the opposite from everybody. Like it's upside down from when I went to the hospital that time. Well, before you go, can you talk to the people with me, please? I'm not have shit to say. <laughs> You don't gotta talk to them, you know the mother man. You just they watch you eat. You talk if you want to. I know I want to. I'm talking.
You want another one? You can give them? No, it's crazy. You enjoy? You want this part? The mm -hmm. mini part? Mm -hmm. Y'all, I be trying. That's all I want. That sauce on my nose. <laughs> you a booger head, that's why. What do I gotta do with that? my sauce. It look like it's not. Duh. Alright, you guys, this is gonna be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this mukbang or mukbang or however you say it. It was kind of like boring. I just talked a lot, but. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and DC Herbal channel for future content like this. Make sure to comment hashtag PGC Mukbang in the comment section. I'm going in, period. Without further ado, I will see you guys in my next video, my PGC.